Dozens of Central Indiana high school students are getting ready to go to Washington to be on hand for history. RTV6's Derek Thomas traveled to Muncie Central before those students head from Indiana to Inauguration Day. The four day trip begins January the 19th. A bulletin board in the hallway is counting down the days. The centerpiece of the trip is the inauguration of Donald Trump as the 45th president of the United States. It gives more substance to what I talk about in the classroom. When you've been there and you've seen it and you've been a part of it, it, it makes it more real for the students. And that's why I wanted to do this trip. 27 students are going, and no one wanted to be there more than Maggie Connolly, but she wanted someone else to be sworn in as president. It was heartbreaking for me to see that result and to realize that I was not yet 18 and could not yet participate in that movement that um, Secretary Clinton had created, and it's something I've looked up to her a lot growing up, and so being able to see her there would have been a great honor, but at the same time, I think President-elect Trump is who we have in office right now, and the only thing that I can do as a young woman is to hope that he hears my voice. It's definitely a time to move forward. There's, regardless of whether you like him or not, or his policies or not, there's going to be big change, and I don't know if anyone really knows quite what's going to happen, and I think a lot of people do want change from our past administration, so it's, it's exciting, but it's also kind of frightening. All the students on the trip have these great inauguration sweaters, and they will visit a host of historic monuments in the days after. Fulton took a trip to D.C. this past summer and took these photos to better prepare himself for the historic adventure. Lauren Rector has the last word. I want to be able to say I was there, and like when people try to say, like, oh, this happened, but it really didn't, I can be like, no, not necessarily. The students say the trip will be one of the highlights of their young lives. They can't wait. Derek Thomas, RTV6.